Yo, what's up guys, my name is the number one Pred, and today what I'll be bringing you guys is a double chem strike on the map Freight, playing a bit of domination in a four-man party, I think four-man party, alarm just went off outside, which is a bit weird, I don't even know, know what alarm it was, but um, it was really, really loud, I'm not sure if you guys heard that or not, but um, yeah, I was using the uh, sweaty tryhard um, weapon the vector CRB with the silencer. No, nope, not the silencer actually. Scrap the silencer, the foregrip, and the red dot sight. And this is probably the killer class setup, as you guys probably saw in one of my live episodes. This gun just completely rips through enemies. As you guys can see, I'm just dropping these enemies like they're nothing. But uh, yeah. The reason why I was using this class is because at the time I'm doing this commentary, I'm not sure about the time you'll be seeing this, but at the, definitely at the time I'm doing the commentary, Clan Wars season is going on, or whatever it is, and um, unfortunately I'm being put against complete tryhards and scrubs who, you know, want to get their bonus for their clan, which is really annoying because I wish it was in, on clans versus clan. But unfortunately, you know, Infinity War would have to, you know, put the challenge on public match because there's like a bonus or something. I don't know what really goes on. But you do have to play publics to uh, rank your clan up and stuff like that. And um, when there's like a C uh, clan wars bonus thing going on, which does suck, unfortunately. But it was all right because I wasn't expecting to get any chem strikes today, of which is the day I'm obviously doing the commentary, as you guys know. And um, I put on the you know the sweaty class to you know counteract the people that want wanted to sweat on me. And uh, it's a funny thing actually because I ran into a clan, a full clan. Um, with yellow clan tag, I can't remember the name, it's like begins with A and um, I was playing drop zone because apparently there's a bonus on there as well which is really really odd but there you go and um, I was playing solo and I get put up against them and I actually know a couple of guys, a couple of them on my friends list but they were still cocky enough to you know play against me and uh, that was probably the worst you know decision they've ever made because I pulled out this class and absolutely destroyed them um, and at the end of the game, they were like, "Oh my God, how are you so good, buddy, buddy?" Oh, I could tell that it's just—it's a bit stupid. I mean, like, why do you want to play him if you know you're going to lose? It's a bit annoying. I was playing solo as well. It's a bit awful. You got to beat me if I'm not solo, surely. My friend joined in later on in the game as well and helped me seal the deal. Um, but I'm pretty sure the deal was already done, anyways. But either way, it was really helpful. Um, I'm not going to, you know, spend the commentary do it talking about how I destroyed a clan on a on, uh, drop zone. But uh, it was kind of funny actually, I wish I was recording, I wasn't recording um, because I forgot to unfortunately, which really did suck, but there you go, that's me all over, just forgetting literally everything that uh, is logical in my mind, so yeah, hopefully you guys enjoy the gameplay in the background. I'm actually going to cut my mic um, short, uh, not my mic, my commentary short in a second because I was actually live comment commentating this gameplay. Um, the reason why I'm not like showing the live commentary because I literally hardly ever spoke in it and it was pretty much pointless, I just wanted to do a post commentary over it. But um, I go ballistic because so I thought I died one of the chem strikes, so I'm just going to you know, cut it short um, right about here. This guy's a pussy. Shit. FUCK! Oh, I got it! So, yeah. And yes, I am mad, bro, because, um, to be fair, would you like dying one off a chem strike because you thought you were shooting someone and you died? Nah, I didn't think so. I wasn't happy either because, as I said earlier, the lobbies were complete, you know, aids from earlier on. So, um, I was, it was literally all of the anger built up into that one rage. I could just lay it off, but stupidly enough for me, I did find out that I did have a chem strike logo in the bottom corner of the screen. Um, saying that obviously I did get that kill and everyone in the party was laughing their heads off at me because I made myself look like a complete fool as always by the way the, these guys were playing like complete arseholes towards the end you'll see like this slug on the floor literally a slug on the floor kills me um, from, from the third street you'll see later on I'm going to drop some music on for the rest of the video because I don't really have much else to talk about for three and a half about three minutes and uh, yeah have a great day and peace You and you know that I like you. You say you want your 
own song and there's nothing I could buy you But yeah, you see the thing is writing a love song's kinda hard How would I start like I met you at a bar? Or how I felt the first time that I saw you Or mention I was nervous the first time that I called you See it's not as easy as it looks I'm coming up with nothing except where to throw the hook His girl a song Knowing that you're tired Running through my mind All day long Damn that was cheesy But you gotta believe me That coming up with a love song Is hard and far from easy Taking the train to see me I gotta thank you for it Trying to write for a week And still only got a chorus Damn It's a wild world, I'll be here for a while Girl, freestyling at a party Just to see you smile, girl I drop a line saying, how you so fine And end it with a yes and no Like, will you be mine? And you'll say, how's he make it rhyme? Or how's he make the time? Never use utensils, but he keeps his cake in line So what you, what you say? Only five seconds have gone by But any more and I can't wait Any longer, I'm scrubbing extra dub on Hoping in the future 